This is a brief explanation of what the gastric sleeve surgery is for weight loss. The gastric sleeve procedure was introduced a little bit over a decade ago. It is a partial removal of the stomach with a stapling device with a residual tube-like looking stomach and a proven track record. The procedure requires the use of a stapling device that will staple and divide the stomach lengthwise, creating a tube-like looking stomach and excising the rest. At OCC, the gastric sleeve has been redesigned to become virtually leak-proof to lessen heartburn it won't distend and cause failure time after the procedure. Thus, it has one of the lowest complication and highest success rates. The gastric sleeve is a relatively safe procedure. It is effective, obtaining around 60% excess weight loss or more. Recent reports have also compared it to similar weight loss as with the gastric bypass, and it has its metabolic effect over diabetes and metabolic syndrome. On the downside, there is a two to 4% risk of leak at the staple line. The enlargement of the sleeve can lead to a failure, and the narrowing residual stomach can create a stenosis. Also, residual reflux and heartburn symptoms have been reported. The OCC technique calls for special attention paid to bougie size or calibration tube, and certain anatomical landmarks like the esophagus, the high area of the stomach, and the mid-stomach. The calibration tube can vary in diameter. 32 French is a standard at OCC. Smaller tubes can cause higher risk of leak, risk of stenosis or narrowing, and symptoms like heartburn, reflux, and intolerance to foods. Larger tubes may result in less than ideal weight loss. During the surgical procedure, a dynamic calibration tube is passed orally into the stomach. Once in place, measurements are taken and the stapling line is executed. The hiatus is the area where the esophagus meets the stomach. This is the area where hiatal hernias occur and require repair before weight loss surgery is finished. There are two areas that require special attention during the gastric sleeve surgery. The high stomach or proximal stomach and the mid stomach. The high stomach, or angle of his, is the area with the highest risk of a leak. The mid-stomach, also known as the incisor angularis, is the site where most strictures occur. A stricture is a narrowing of the tube-like stomach that can cause leaks or symptoms later on. At OCC, years of research have resulted in the modifying of the technique, creating a safer, more effective procedure. Additional risk of leak can include the use of surplus staplers, incorrect application of the stapler to the tissue, torsion, kinks, or zigzags of any kind, or a lack of a buttress or oversewing technique. The OCC oversewing technique creates a smooth and symmetrical sleeve with a virtually leak-proof staple line and offers a second protection against a distended sleeve and failure later on. It also provides a simple fix if a narrowing or stenosis occurs. At OCC, we proudly introduce Calibra, the dynamic calibration interface. The dynamic calibration tube is connected to an iPad interface. This proprietary technology has been developed by R&D specialists in conjunction with Obesity Control Center's team of experts. During the surgical procedure, the anesthesiologist will introduce the dynamic calibration tube orally passed into the stomach. Where dynamic calibration will occur, the stapling and the stapling will be performed. Testing for leaks is performed through a flat tire test, a barium swallow after the surgical procedure, and a drain would be the triple line of defense against a leak. A barium swallow is performed under x-ray to confirm the integrity of the new gastric sleeve, visualize the anatomy of the knee stomach, and have a baseline for future studies. Gastric sleeve offers the lowest complication rate with one of the highest success rates. 
avoiding the known complications such as leaks, stenosis, failure because of distension, and the frequent heartburn associated to the technique.